So we're here with Komura Tech, and yes. who are you? Uh, I'm president of Komura Tech. And uh, what are we looking at here? Uh, because that we made a kind of printed uh, electrodes and to assemble some components on it, and this is very thin and light. That's why to demonstrate that by uh, printing on the balloon. And here, what are we looking at? Uh, this is the same there? Yeah, this is the same. This uh, thickness is almost two micrometers film. And I even put the circuit on it. And uh, I hope this is useful against the future biotechnology or biosensors also. Biotechnology, so yeah. uh, patches you yes, put on patches. the skin? Yeah. And, uh, and uh, so how soon is this available? Uh, <laughs> Hope so, within five years. <laughs> within five years? Why so long? Can I do faster? No, already the, the, uh, we can attach the film on a balloon and that the skin or healthcare things is still need a uh, long time to... Because uh, there's a lot of movements mm. and uh, it's better not to break the system, right? That's right. So you have more challenges to, to fix? Can we see? Can yes. look at that? What is it? What are you saying there? Uh, is this part of your yeah, expanding uh, technology? Uh, we are producing uh, machine also, printing machine. Uh, like is this, this uh, very small footprint one meter. Yeah. And we can make this type of uh, output from these printers, even gravity offset printing and flexograph printing, uh, multiple in one machine. Silver nano, yes, uh, copper uh, nano. Yes, what do you do? Our machine is now available for. Silver nano, copper nano, silver nano wire, and conductive polymer like a P, P dot PSS things, or even organic LED. And uh, in future, of course, the, by the printing uh, MLCC yeah. or uh, organic transistor for the future, and right. that is gonna be used for the touch panel or additive layer, optical layer also. Nice. And uh, what, what are we looking at here? What is that? Yes, this is we show the kind of transparent film. Uh, it's by, made by uh, gravia offset printing. Actually, in between these two electrodes, there are wire mesh here. Uh, but the wire mesh line space is 5 micron and 300 micron space. That's why almost invisible. Then, uh, still we have continued to developing the kind of finer size of the electrode, but uh, at this moment, the limit is a uh, five micron uh, wire mesh. And so this invisible, transparent. Uh, it's just a uh, light in in the air. Yeah, is with nothing nearly. There is right. something, but how does it work? It connects and yeah, connects in between. And here is a wire mesh, and this side also another wire mesh, and both side uh, to conduct uh, the electro uh, electric power from one side to another side. That's why this LED turned on. Nice. So this is going to be bio. It's going to be what else? This is going to be the kind of a conductive film. Uh, actually, the, this kind of wire mesh is here. And uh, the totally uh, by using this kind of 5 micrometer uh, line and the space 300 micrometer, then uh, you can make the kind of film, conductive, almost transparent conductive film by using this technology. Nice. And that will enable to the EMI shield, shield film, or in, even in future touch panel film also.